Did you find it? Okay, I see a purple toad that looks like it's been here for six years. There's like chips and Fritos and. Oh, sweet. Take the snacks too. Heck yeah. Take the whole thing. Yeah, I just never seen one like this. It's like gray. It looks like it has an ear wig. Like it, it hangs around your ear. Not good. But it's a mic. Okay. Well, we'll see what it does. It is what it is. It's all that's in there that wasn't food. Okay. I'll see you in a bit. All right. You got breakfast going? No, there's breakfast in the purple toe. Hurry up and get here. You're almost going to be late again. Oh, you be quiet. Bye. You're never late. So unlike my dog Izzy, you are never late. Skip dog is always late. I guess I better feed you some breakfast, huh? My name's Kylie and you're watching Eerie Extreme. Your lights are on. Filter them on. By themselves? Yeah, it's amazing. Is that, God, man, is that like something out of a 1950s doctor's office? Holy crap. How does that work? I have no, it looks like it goes around your ear. All right, so here's the story. Me, Skippy, Allie, and Beck are receiving a challenge from the Minnow Man in 10 minutes. Uh, okay, well, she's gonna look like Madonna. We'll let Allie wear that. Skippy's on time for the first time ever. But of course, everyone else is late. All what right. are we doing? Do I need to put my waiters I on? I think we're celebrating. Celebrating what? The fact that you're the first time in five years you're not late. I took a screenshot of the map <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm not kidding to prove it because I knew you would, you would say I was late. We literally have no idea what we're doing yet, but as always, I'm prepared for anything. All right, let's hear the excuses. And here's our first tardy one. It's too early for this. Let's hear it. Hear what? Your excuse, you're late. I'm literally... You're late. Five minutes late. That's five minutes overtime we gotta put well, in. Beck's not here either, so. Beck's here. No, she's not. She got here early. No, she's not. Oh my gosh, the sun's popping out. Lake looks beautiful. So now we just need a cameraman. Waiting on Beck. What, Dave? I was, better be good, cause I was jamming. Hey, Beck, it's Terry. <laughs> hey, we're just checking oh, out. Oh, hey, we're sorry. Che we're checking out where you at. Eight minutes out. Ah, oh, okay. Challenge call is supposed okay. to come at 8.30. You're going to be late. I'm trying. Are you filming this? No. no. <laughs> what a bunch of liars. <laughs> I hate being late. I'm stressed. Why? Because I'm, I'm late. I hate it. But you always are. I know. It's your identity. Oh, great. What you should do when you're late is just blame it on somebody else. That's what I do. Hey, Dave. It's Kirk from East End Angler. How you doing? Good, you? Good. You got the crew there? Yes, I do. Great. I have a challenge for you guys, and it's a good one. This challenge comes to you from Chloe from Ashtabula, Ohio. She challenges you to catch a huge fish over 10 pounds on a spoon. And yes, there is a catch. You must make it yourself out of a spoon in your silverware drawer. Wait, what? what? You, mean, <laughs> you mean the lure? Make it. Yeah. Hope your wife doesn't kill you. Good luck. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> Thanks, Kirk. You're welcome. Thank you. All right. Bye. 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 How late does Ann sleep? <laughs> I need to see what a spoon looks like. I'll go get the lure so we can show, yeah. so we can look at what it is. And then where's the silver drawer? Do you know anything about metal work? Yeah. No. That's the problem. Terry does. I was asking Terry. Do you uh, know something? So that's a spoon. A spoon that looks nothing like a real spoon. What about like a thing you use butter with? It's like a thick knife. You mean a butter knife? It's not a butter knife. <laughs> oh, I know what she means. We'll go through the drawer and see what she has, but it has my problem is, should we call her? Like, should I take a picture? Because what if it's like my... <laughs> oh. What if it's like grandmother's spoon or something, you know? All right, well, let's look for a spoon because we got to figure out how, All right. how to make it. Allie, read the Facebook comments. We asked our fans what we could do today. We might as well try to knock another one out. Why not? Here's one from a really long name, Stephen Andrew Lance Gordon. He's got four names. Yeah, yeah. Well, first, what? Stephen. Andrew. Lance. Gordon. That's fun. Lake trout on an ice fishing rod and no more than six pound test. Fish has to weigh at least 13 pounds to complete the challenge. How long ago was that? A day, one day ago. Yesterday? Sure. Okay, so we're gonna do better than that. We're gonna go catch a laker on like two pounds. I can't see anything. Let's look at the spoon. The other day coming in on two pound test. Kirk kind of misled me a little bit. We thought we were going perch fishing, so this is a major curveball. I just want to get out of here before Ann wakes up. But I like it, as long as my wife doesn't shoot me. 
Uh, so what's our goal here? Well, it depends. Should what I call her? Like, just to make sure we're not cutting one of my grandma's front. Look at that one. This is the one. It's pliable. Yeah, but we look how old it looks. It looks sentimental. This one's made in China, so it can't be that sentimental. That's a flimsy one. The, the goal is to find something flimsy, yeah, something right, so we, we can, can break, break it. it. Yeah, because can you read what that says? It just says stainless. Should I call her? She's not going to let, she's going to say no. See that design? That could be worth. Yeah, that's what I was saying. Can you Technically, we could cut one of these and she'll probably never know. Have Allie ask. Can you go that way? Yeah, Allie, you do it. I tried calling Ann. She didn't answer, which is weird because I let it ring an entire time. I tried. I don't think these are anything special. You could replace these. The Kaplan's will replace it. She has three of the same ones. She yeah, let's go with this one. Yeah, Kaplan's. Okay. This has the most wiggle in it. Great idea. Okay, I'm calling Kaplan. Drill right here and put your hook. Boom. Done. Oh, so what, what you, I you see. The what whole you, thing, so now it's that monster. We gotta drill two holes. Hey, Dave. Hey, Luke. Yes, sir. I got the crew here. Everybody say hi, Luke. Hi, Luke. Hi, Luke. Hi, Luke. Um, hey, guys. We. I'm about ready to cut one of my wife's kitchen spoons. <laughs> if something goes haywire, yeah, there's she, she can choose from about 28 different spoons. Okay, oh, that'll like work. big serving spoons. Oh, absolutely. Yeah, and if you need more props, we'll give you a handful of them. Okay, cool. <laughs> Have a good day. Hey, thanks, Luke. Okay, now that makes me feel a lot better. A best option to get a replacement at a commercial place is one of these. You know, this looks like real silver. You know what real silver looks yeah, like, right? Yeah, this weighs nothing. This is not real <laughs> silver. Excuse this. <coughs> she has three of them. She'll be fine. This is the one I'm going to get whacked with. <gasps> Ow. That hurt. All right. All right. Where's the spoon? Right here. Here we go to the garage. This ought to be good. Do you have a cordless drill or any type of drill? Yeah, I got, I, I have drills everywhere. What are we looking for? We're looking for. There's a hammer. That would help. Um, I don't know if we'll need a file or not. Well, let's just go with what we got here. He said six pound test. This is two. Like you can literally break it like that. This could take a while. I think we'll find the tools and parts that we need, but I can promise you, none of us have a clue what we're about to do. Let the games begin. Let's build us a spoon. Where would you want the hole to be if I can get it to As work? close to the edge as we can get it, and it's gotta be centered. Like right there. And then the other hole we're gonna have to make, cause we're not using this whole thing. Well, we'll wait till we break it and then we'll figure out where that one goes. How are we gonna break that? I'm not sure yet. So I gotta find split rings and a hook. Don't hurt yourself. I'm not, I'm trying to get the drill out. Hold the wood. No, let her do it. We have a hole. I can see you. <laughs> Are we gonna put like a swivel off of this? Big old sucker. Let's see. If you can't figure it out, let Allie do it. <laughs> she files her fingernails. I can't believe this is working. And then see this? We're taking a snap off of a big musky lure. Where, where do you want to break it? How about we start there? Draw where you want to cut okay. it. Let Allie do it. And it is Terry's fault. And Luke from Capital. Can you get a close-up on this? Definitely Luke and Terry's fault. You don't want them to hold it with vice grips? And Kirk. Good job. Right. Is that big enough? Allie, hold it. You got it. You got no, it. No, no, no. Nothing can happen. Hold you it. You don't know that. Yes, I do. What can possibly happen? What could possibly go wrong? You ready? Yeah. Hopefully we have time to fish. You're not allowed to wear that hat. Why? Because it's mine. Too bad we can't cut that into a point right there. Allie, see if that fits in there. Use that your fingernails. Part. That should fit. Yeah, that, that'll fit. Do you have a Dremel? Yeah. Can I bend it? Yeah, it'll bend back. Does it yeah. go in? Yep. Okay, so that's all we need. Okay. Vaz. Vaz. It should be down here for other. Why? Safety? Yeah, because so it's sturdier. Put the... No, I need to be cutting. able to... I need to be able to... Oh, I can tell okay. you. Okay. Dave? What? Draw the picture on the other side. Terry. Maybe, yeah. Don't you, you think somebody? you should put this nope. right there? Just trust me. <laughs> Oh, baby. Okay. <laughs> okay, now. You're a kid. All right, so if you know where the hole is, let me drill the hole first, because it'll be a lot easier having the handle oh, hold yeah. onto it. Okay. What a smart person. He's really not. <laughs> Can you hold the handle? <laughs> Don't you think somebody... you should put this nope, right there? just trust me. This is working way better than I thought it would. Good job, Allie. Jeez, calm down. I'm shocked. That's that good. was so much easier than I thought. Dude, it I'm did. impressed. Let's high five the camera lady. Yeah, for sure. It looks like 
rubbed it on you. I know. Are we gonna paint it too? Oh, uh, yeah. What what do you do? This to is it? gonna look like a real war, dude. Let's make it let's make it, let's make it nice. Oh you have nail polish? You have I have nail polish? This should work. It's too yeah. Cool. Oh pretty. It's the perfect color, you know that, right? If we paint it, is it still gonna be shiny? We're not we're gonna, gonna paint, paint the whole thing. thing. We need to do uh, like some see uh, maybe oh. just like the black, but use that the purple. Uh, Let's just use this. Yeah. Yeah. Huh? You think that's close enough now? Should be. I tell you, man, there's no way you're gonna catch one of those fish on a two pound test. There's three parts to this challenge. The first one was to make a lure out of a spoon from the silverware drawer at Dave's house. Second challenge today is from Stephen Andrew Lance Gordon <laughs> to use an ice fishing pole to catch a 13 pound fish with six pound test line. From Winston, Johnson, James, George, John. <laughs> Gordon was the last Gordon. One. Fish has to weigh at least 13 pounds to complete the challenge. But we're gonna change it up and do two pound tests. And our last goal is to catch a PA lake. <laughs> what? Right, you can do it, you can do it. Right. I don't, I forget what it is. What? My head itches. The Go. PA. Wait. <laughs> God. The PA state record lake trout. <laughs> state record. We are not quitting until we catch it. Dude, is this enough play? Yeah. There you go. Put the hook on. You put the hook on. All right, we got ourselves a lure. Look at that. Happy face is upside down, but we're gonna fix that. <laughs> Man, I'm getting excited. This is awesome. We get to go back out there and play with the Lakers. We caught them within five pounds of the state record recently, so there's a legitimate shot at that. Plus, the last time we filmed, Allie wasn't able to make it. She's got a real shot at catching the PB of her lifetime. I just hope this spoon works. That went way smoother than I thought it would. You're just gonna go down the side like that with blue, just like that orange is. Make it nice, Allie. How long does this stuff take to dry? It's instant. Boy, does that stuff stink. Yeah. So baits like this tend to spin around and twist your line. We need a swivel. I don't have one big enough to fit our spoon. Yeah, it's not gonna do it's it. It's not gonna do it. We need a swivel or it's, it's superfluous. Super flow, what? There, <laughs> First of all, that's not a word and if it was, he has no idea what it would mean. We'll tie it up the line, make a leader. So we, what we need is for this, this thing is not gonna spin. I can't wait to see what this stupid looking thing does. You understand what a swivel is, Allie? Mm-hmm, like a swivel chair. Yeah, just like that. All right, there she is. It's ugly as all get out. We don't have anything extra, so if we break this off, we lose, we fail. Let's, Let's go fishing. It was way too Good. close, I'm pretty sure. So I'm putting on a little tiny spoon on this one. It's huge for ice fishing, right? While Allie's catching the state record, I'll be doing this. <laughs> okay, let's go. You ready? You doing there, Tara? I'm fixing the spoon that Dan spooned you that you broke. <laughs> it looks really good. Should we write an yeah, apology just note write, on it? Sorry. Oh boy. <laughs> What's funny is you guys won't be here when I have to deal with the wrath. <laughs> Wait, where's the spoon? Did somebody take it? It's right here. Oh. That looks cool. That looks arrogant. Yeah, that's caught. So the spoon is done. The replacement spoon in the drawer looks great. And we're off to our local Lake Erie gem, the Northeast Marine. We have four gallons of gas in the boat. It's supposed to blow 30 out of the south today, which will get us to Canada pretty dang quick. Yo. Hey, I just have a quick question. Yeah. Do you have your boat strapped? No. Ooh, that could have been bad. Okay, let's clippy the boaty. Boat is now secure. Whew, good eye, Beck. That could have been bad. I don't know how you make it through a whole day. How do you make it through, <laughs> how are you alive at your age? Here. How am I alive Wait, at my Beck's age? coming. Are you guys fighting? Uh, we're bickering. What do you mean? We got yeah. it. We're hooked up and ready to go now. Watch, don't run her over. Good job, good choices. Let's fish. What's the biggest fish you ever caught? Catfish. That catfish on the show? How big was it? It was probably like 10 pounds. Yeah. So you need something over 10 pounds. No, we need something over 31 pounds. Yeah. What are our chances? I'd say catching a fish on the spoon we made are pretty good. Um, really? Yeah. Why? Because it, it came out a heck of a lot better than I thought it was going to come out. But the chances on the ice fishing pole, I think, are like 1% that you're gonna land it. You may hook something. But the problem is, is how they try to run to Mexico right. and you can't stop them. Like right. they'll take all the line off. Well, the how road. much line do you have in there? 50 I yards? Don't. Not even? Mm, there's probably a hundred yards on there. Okay. 
please support our Erie Extreme partners. Marquette Savings Bank. We create the Avonia Tavern, Fishing Online, Bentley Tree Care, East End Angler, A. Kaplan Company, Driscoll Tax and Accounting, Fisherman's Haven, The Band 814, and our friends at Taste and See Youth for Christ and Pray Erie. Thanks for watching. Hi, I'm Nate from The Band 814. Band 814 is accepting bookings for 2024. Festivals, fairs, concerts, youth events, worship nights, banquets, and parties. Email us at theband814 at gmail.com for more info. Check out our YouTube channel and follow us on Facebook, Instagram, and TikTok. And listen to our album on Spotify or Apple Music. See you at the next show. Do you think we'll win? Huh? <laughs> So we get to the marina and this has been a special place for me for a long time. It is the perfect spot, super close to world-class fishing and I hear it's about to get a facelift. So that is really cool. Yeah, it's not a pretty day. That's no, it sure. isn't. It's an ugly day. Windy, cold, blah. I just hope the boys stay happy and warm. By boys, I mean girls. You are responsible for your wake. This is a mission, boys. Can I call you boys? No. Okay, don't anybody die. <laughs> okay. We got 3.8 gallons of gas. I love getting wet. You won't get wet anymore. Oh. <laughs> oh. Oh. <laughs> the good thing is, is if we run out of gas, we'll blow back to the ramp instead yeah. of blowing to Canada. Oh, hang on. Oh, <laughs> don't break the camera. <laughs> Here on Lake Erie, we're gonna try to catch us a lake trout. Oh. A little bit bumpy out here on the lake today. I love it. I love it getting wet. Oh! You know what? Maybe you should look forward. Yeah, maybe I should put the camera down. All right, we made it. And this is why we don't fish with fluffy white gloves. Here it is. <laughs> oh, God. You have to get you're helpless. Barb. She can get it. Take your other glove. You have to take gloves off. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Yeah, here you we go. do. I do. <laughs> All right, here we go. I say we just start throwing this thing right off the bat and knock it out. Yep. Can't wait to see what it looks like in the water. Put it in the water. It is. Oh, wait. I can see it. <laughs> okay, pull it in. Pull it in so you don't drop it. Okay, this is the most important part. So, time what to be a man. What if I fall in? Just don't fall in. If you fall in, just jump back in the boat. Right? It's freezing. I'll die. No, you won't. We'll warm you up. Cold water kills. If I fall in, I'll kill him. Really? There's You're no way is. I can stand up there. Yeah, you can. My balance is so bad. Just, just, you can do it. I'm going to go on my knees. Okay, you can. <laughs> It'll look way better if you can figure out how to stand up. All right, Whoa. here we go. This is it. Homemade spoon. It's going to cost me a freaking whack or two with a wooden spoon on my, you know what? First cast. Oh, it's got some resistance to it. All right, so Allie. I'm waiting. I'm gonna, it's, got, it's deep, so i got to let it sink to the bottom. And then you're just going to reel it and get ready. All right, just reel it at a medium speed. Just keep reeling? Don't drop the rod. Keep reeling it. All right, how long is this going to take? Come on, first cast. What, you just have to keep doing just this? Just keep reeling. And, and jerk when you get a bite. Ah! Here, let me do it again. Oh, it did. Here. Yeah. Oh. Bomber. Let's try it again. Got one. Boom. I got Yay. one. Here. Here. Second cast. <laughs> Second cast. Keep it tight. Wait. Keep it tight. Oh. Keep it tight. Hold on tight. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh my God. Now f let it fight. If you can stand up, stand up. Look at the size of that, dude. I'm not kidding. <laughs> Allie, do not lose that. I'm trying. It's okay, heavy. Okay, so remember what I said about the state record. It's heavy. I cannot believe how strong this fish is. I'm going to fall into the water. Help. Help. No, you're fine. <laughs> I gotta pull them Am I, though? Got him? No, I need help. Use two hands. No, you're good. <laughs> yeah. You're good. Here, you. you no, 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 that. you got it. But don't lose it, because this is seriously. Pull the rod up. <laughs> don't let him win. Don't let him beat you. He don't is beating me. It's going to push me in the water. It's not going to push you in the water. It might. <laughs> Pull it over this way. What way? Please don't get off. Please don't get off. Wow. We can't lose this one. Where are you at? Where are you at, sucker? <laughs> so you big. It? No, not yet. Oh my gosh. Wow. It doesn't fit in the dang net. <laughs> Woo!
Ooh. Holy crap. <laughs> In the net. That's a big one. That's our spoon. Woo! Yay! Wow, look at the size of that. We beat the challenge. Challenge complete. Dude, this is what I'm talking about. The state record fish Here. is in the school record. We already completed the challenge. <laughs> One of them. One of them, yeah, we have to So you can put Second the- Second cast. You gotta put the spoon in, in the camera because it's challenge complete. Wait, so why does he like that? I'm confused because it's not like food or anything. All right, I think I'm gonna answer that because there might be somebody else out there thinking the same thing. Our spoon is supposed to resemble a minnow. And to us, it may not look like a minnow, but to him, it did. Hold tight, like don't. Let, you don't said move. don't. Don't pull, just let me pull. Don't pull, pull, let me pull. I don't want pull. you to pull, I just don't want you to move. <gasps> oh, <look>, ew! <laughs> Can you see it at all? It just says CGE complete. The biggest fish you'll ever catch in your life. Ew, you want to guess? Yeah, guess? yeah, I would I'll guess. I'll say 24. That's my guess. Six. No, it's over 21. We just got to hold it still. I'm trying. I'm shaking though. It's heavy. Flip it off the floor. Isn't it off the floor? It's not gonna stay on. It's 21 something. Here, hold it. No. She's gonna. Stick what do you her mean hand? no? <laughs> this is the best picture you'll ever have in your life. <laughs> That's why I told you. Look how bloody your hands are. Doesn't matter. Do it. Do it. You get have to. You're gonna get slimy. That's what they make washing machines for. Do it. I am not holding this fish. Grab it. <laughs> Put your hand right here. There's nothing that can hurt you. This fish is disgusting and has blood all over it. I am not holding it. So let me get this straight. You're the star in a fishing show, but you're not going to hold a fish. <laughs> yes, you are. Put your hand right where Are those his gills? That's disgusting! All right. Put your hand. Oh my gosh. Put your hand right there. Do it. Uh, I don't want to. You will. Do it. <laughs> Come on. Do it as soon as you get it in the water. I can't. Do it. I literally can't. Yes, you can. Okay. Just okay. To have faith. Okay. Now grab him right here. Okay. Now look at Terry. <laughs> and hold him out. He's so slimy. There you go. <laughs> nice. Nice job. 21 Hi. pounder. Good All right. Job, now let him go. Okay. Bye. Uh -oh. oh, he's upside down. Well, he'll spin around. Yeah. No, he'll, he'll live. He's they, living. They're, they're he's super fine. durable. There he's, he's fine. going. He's there fine. he's going. Bye. He's going. Okay, do it again. <laughs> <laughs> you want to catch one on the house spoon again? Yeah, because it worked. Second cast. I got the little ice rod out with the two pound test. All right, here. Leave it sink forever. See how your line's tight? Watch it. It'll get loose. There, it is go. loose. Reel it. Reel it faster. Slow down. Did you see how I was giving it twitches down? Put your rod down a little bit. Yeah, go. Yeah, just keep doing that every once in a while. Okay, I got one. You got one. She got one. <laughs> On the house spoon. You should be thanking Ann. <laughs> Thank you, Ann. <laughs> <laughs> ah! You may have to go into production with these. I don't think it's that big though. Yes, it is. It doesn't feel as There's, big as the last is. one. They fight when they get closer. It's like under the boat. Is it on or not? Oh, here it is. It's right here. It's right here. Dang, it's another giant one. Nice one. Get the net! <laughs> See what I mean how big these are? This fish is unbelievably strong. Hurry! I Dude. Can't. Oh my gosh. In the net. Got him. Did you get it? In the net. <laughs> Woo! Scooped him in the net. Ugh. Look at that spoon in its mouth. Do you see that? Chloe, the girl's name is Chloe, right? Yeah. What a good challenge, Chloe. Really good Shouldn't you get the spoon out of his mouth first? Yes. That made me nervous. Here, want to hold it? How do I do it again? Yeah, Three casts, two fish. If he swaps, hold him up to hold him to back. Which has got the better sunlight? I do. I do. Get my phone. Dave, get my phone. I'm sorry. Right slimy. there. Right there. Grab it. All right. Jeez. You want me to just move it? Just take a picture. It's on the camera. Okay. Another 20 pounder. Excellent. Okay, little guy. Yeah. <laughs> Here's the little two pound test rod. We get this challenge so many times every year, it's not even funny. <laughs> First Can time. I start doing it now or not? Yeah, real. Big fish on a little rod. I got one. Fish on. I got one. Seriously? Whoa. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> First catch. <laughs> but can we land it? 
I don't know. I hope Anne's not mad at me from the spoon. I'm really sorry. But the good news is we fixed it. And I think it looks pretty good. And Luke from Kaplan's is gonna replace the spoon for Anne. Thank you, Chloe, for this challenge. It was a good one. And for your chance to win a free Erie Extreme t-shirt, head over to our Instagram or Facebook and comment on our most recent post. See you next week. Are we done yet? How much longer? I'm freezing. Yeah. And my legs are wet. Anything else? <laughs> <laughs>